subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates all of us have witnessed if not participated in a marble and spoon race as kids the race barely grabs eyeballs in fact it often attracts the weakest of the sport aspirants and for good reason it is slow and boring it does not seem to require any special skill the participants do not need the best level of fitness so what makes the race entertaining the fact that barely one or two participants manage to finish the race the rest get dismissed as soon as the marble on their spoon rolls off as naive as it may sound stock markets are no different you must first finish to finish first and that's why you must know how to create wealth from just 1% of the listed businesses hi i'm tanushri banerjee editor of equity masters blue chip recommendation service stock select welcome to safe stocks where we discuss ideas to create and preserve wealth in the safest businesses if you haven't subscribed to the equity master youtube channel yet please do so and click on the bell icon to get notifications for my latest videos at the risk of sounding too simplistic the very nature of stocks that create the biggest wealth is that they are the rarest of the rare unfortunately most investors who enthusiastically enter the stock markets withdraw or get dismissed too soon few others manage to go some way but their stocks keep failing in wealth creation in fact they roll off like the uneven marbles just a handful of investors manage to get to the finish line of their long investing horizon to see the stocks compound into true wealth the similarity between the marble and spoon race and stock markets is not unscientific in the marble and spoon race most participants underestimate the importance of posture concentration and goal setting as a result barely anyone reaches the finish line the usual traits of speed strength and agility do not serve well here turns out the biggest wealth creators in the stock markets are businesses that have thrived for decades they are today just 1% of all the listed businesses investing in them requires the skill that does not apply to 99% of the other listed stocks in fact you can literally call it a hack any marble and spoon expert like yours truly would like to tell you that the hack for the race is simple place the marble carefully at the center of the spoon and keep your eyes glued to the marble and the finish line Similarly 90% of the effort of wealth creation in stocks is zeroing in on the right businesses and holding them for the longest investing tenure paying any attention to the chaos around or turning to see other participants can be the biggest risk in the marble and spoon race similarly too much focus on other investors or the volatility in the stock markets can never be the recipe for good stock market fortunes Now if you're worried of an impending market crash hurting your dreams of creating stock market fortunes you're not alone. What if I were to tell you that there's a strategy that is not only perfectly positioned to survive a market crash but it also stands to gain immensely from the market crash. In the stock markets the fortune of the benchmark indices has come to rest on few star performers. The bulk of the investor money just comes to them. and investors firmly believe that only these stocks could create wealth of the long term but the fact is that the performance of the index stocks will at best trail the indices of the long term so if you're looking to make big gains in the blue chips of the next decade then you need to look beyond the sensex stocks you see a lot of the quality blue chips are not restricted to the sensex alone If you widen your horizon a bit and look at let's say the BSE 200 index then there are quite a few blue chip stocks that are set to deliver handsome gains over the long term. The easiest way to track what could help stocks have a long runway of superlative returns is to find qualities that can help them overcome every crisis. For instance, capital efficiency. The companies that prioritize reinvesting profits to earn higher returns on their shareholders equity rarely go wrong in capital allocation. Such companies are careful with their capex and acquisitions plus surplus cash is often distributed to shareholders the idea is that the more profitable the company gets the more value it will create low leverage minimum debt which is the debt to equity ratio is extremely important for companies to tide over periods of tight liquidity and high interest rates profitability with low capex 
companies that have already done the hard work of building plant net machinery or network for future growth are typically in a right phase to benefit from their efforts. Scope for PE expansion Stocks with low price to earnings multiples tend to have a huge headroom for PE expansion if the business and the management were in the di right direction. If I must pick just one characteristic or ingredient that has been the key catalyst of multi bagger stocks over the years, it would be their PE expansion. Larger the PE expansion, higher has been the quantum of returns for the top multi baggers. Here's data to prove my point. The top 100 companies which gain about 1000% have had extraordinary fundamentals. But what really made the difference between them and the 10,000% gainers was the quantum of expansion in PE multiples. Last but not the least, Technology Catalyst. Technology has the power to change lives over time. Imagine a world in the future where an autonomous vehicle picks you up for work, it plays your favourite playlist and it makes a quick stop for your morning coffee. All this without you having to reach your wallet or your phone. This is how devices with Internet of Things could transform our everyday lives. The reason this technology is so important is because it could transform the future growth rates of multiple businesses. When I say that I mean businesses as diverse as healthcare, automobiles, financial services, retail and agriculture. Now as an investor looking for exponential profits over the next few decades, you cannot just look for tried and tested businesses or the most popular brands. Rather, you need to look for stocks where technology is acting as a huge catalyst of change that could offer exponential growth in the years to come. So, just one person of the listed stocks can be the true game changers for your portfolio. Having the patience, perseverance and discipline to find and hold on to them can offer the compounding effect that 99% of the other stocks can't. Hope you like this video. Stay tuned for more such videos on the safest and most appealing permanent wealth creating stocks. Thank you. Our new research uncovers some shocking truths behind today's hottest investment opportunity, electric vehicles. Don't invest your money in EV stocks before seeing our research. Click here to sign up for our special event to know it all for free.